Hey guys, Jason Shepard here alongside my lovely wife, Ashley. You guys know as the real brains behind M0A.com and everything else. We're sitting on the ground here at uh, the Ocala Airport, Class Delta Airport. I just want to show you a Class Delta departure out of this airport. So first things first, before I do anything, I want to not only make sure I've got my taxiway diagram out, but I also want to grab the ATIS and figure out what's happening. So let's do that together here really quick. Three, zero, one, two. Landing in the parking room, way three, six, visual approach in use. Notice airmen, caution bird activity, large spots of buzzards, all quadrants around the airport. Advise on initial contact, you have information, golf. Golf. Ocala, tower information, golf, one, seven, five, zero, Zulu, weather, wind, calm, visibility, one, zero. Night conditions are clear, below one, two, thousand. Temperature, two, zero, two, point, eight, now, coming to three, zero, one, two. Landing in the parking room, way three, six, visual approach in use. Notice airmen, caution bird activity. All right, so we have information, golf, winds are calm. I've got my altimeter. They're using runway 36. I've got all the pertinent information. I recommend two guys be writing that sort of stuff down. That's a relatively easy ATIS, but still writing that sort of stuff down so you can kind of remember that if you're following me. All right, so we've got all that. Now it's time to give ground a call. I need to know where I'm at. Well, I'm on the north side of the airport. I'm at the, what's called the North T Hangar. So that's geographic specific to here. You could be at Landmark Aviation, whatever the FBO is, doesn't matter. Let them know, you know, where you're at and that you have the current information and where you want to go. Do I want to stay in the pattern? Do I want to depart to the west? In this case, we're going to depart to the west. All right, so we're going to do all that, but before we do that, we're going to give them a cold call first. These guys are busy. They may be on the other line. They may be doing both ground and tower. Give these guys a cold call first, and here's what I mean by that. Ocala Ground, Skyhawk 7159, Quebec. Skyhawk 7159, Quebec, Ocala Ground. Afternoon, sir, 7159, Quebec, on the ground at the North T Hangars with Information Golf, ready to taxi VFR to the west. 7159, Quebec, runway 36, taxi via taxiway Alpha, Information Golf is current. 36 via Alpha, and we have Golf, thank you, 59, Quebec. All right, so we're going to begin our tax now, 3-6 via Alpha. Now, we're spoiled. Ocala is a very easy airport uh, as far as taxi. I mean, all we have is really taxiway Alpha. So we're going to go ahead here. We're going to jump out on Alpha, and we're going to head on down to 3-6. I can verify that all uh, with my taxiway diagram here. So we're going to continue on um, this way. And, and you see what we did there? We made a cold call. I wanted to get their attention uh, first and foremost. So that was important. We got their attention. They came back, acknowledged us. And then what I told them, I told them where I was at. I told them that I had information golf. I took all that time to listen to it. I better tell them that I actually did do that. Uh, clear left, clear right, and we're going left. Um, and then I told them I'm ready to taxi and where I want to go. I want to go VFR to the west. Where I want to stay in the pattern, uh, it's going to be closed traffic. So you can tell them these sort of things. All right, so that's cool. So guys, we got, we got a really long taxi here. So we're going to go ahead and speed up through this part, and I'll catch you guys when we're just about ready to uh, depart. See you guys over there. All right, guys, so we just completed our uh, run-up, and it's time to go ahead and give Tower a call. Before I do that, let me go ahead and shut my door. That's all good. I'm going to flip-flop over to Tower, and I want to tell them where I'm at. In this case, I'm at Alpha 11 and 3-6. Now, I'm not even going to waste my breath and Tower's breath if somebody's like on short, short final coming in here just for them to tell me to hold short. All right, so I'm going to peek, and you know what? Just because it's a controlled airport doesn't mean you trust the controller all the time. I mean, we're only, uh, controllers are only humans uh, as well as pilots, okay? So just kind of look, make sure everything looks good. Um, that all looks great. Let's go ahead and give them a call. Click. Now, there is no need to cold call now. We're already talking to somebody at Ocala. So the cold call, no need to do that. So we've got that covered. All right, so let's go ahead and uh, let's make that call now. And Ocala Tower, Skyhawk 7159, Quebec, ready to go 36 at Alpha 11. Skyhawk 7159, Quebec, Ocala Tower, runway 36, cleared for takeoff, uh, left turn westbound approved. 3-6, clear for takeoff, left turn uh, westbound approved. Thank you, 7159 Quebec. All right, so we're looking good, we're cleared. We're gonna go do our lights, camera, action, make sure everything's good as far as that goes. I'm still watching final. Still double checking everything to make sure it all looks good. Looking down the runway, making sure nobody else is sneaking out there or anything else uh, has jumped out there. Notice too, I didn't take an intersection departure. I love using full length. 
because it's that one day I'm a wish I had full length runway that I took the intersection. So I'm always uh, telling myself to use the full length. Out here nicely on center line, line up that magnetic compass just a hair bit better there on the head indicator. Wheels are hitting the floor, smoothly applying that full power. Nice new engine, nice and powerful. Verify engine gauge is green, airspeed's coming alive, here comes Rotate, and my friends, we are up and out of here. So I'll be doing some more videos here uh, on various radio communications. And, you know, this video is a result of you guys asking your questions. So any questions you guys have, feel free to chime in with the comment box or shoot me an email and get your questions answered. So guys, uh, enjoy the rest of your day, and most importantly, remember, but a good pilot is always learning. Have a great day, guys. See ya. Hey there. If you think this video was good, you're going to love the over 400 other videos inside our exclusive members-only online ground school. Ground School Academy members enjoy weekly live webinars, mock check rides, and customized written test prep. Ground School Academy members not only have access to the number one rated online ground school, but also the best guarantee in the industry. Pass your check ride or we'll pay for it. Visit groundschoolacademy.com to learn more and become an online ground school member today.